Welcome to the CCH Access Financial Prep and the CCH Access Engagement video series. In this video, we'll walk through the ability to add, edit, and delete financial subgroups. So we'll go ahead and start by looking at the financial statements. And let's say, for example, for your financial statements, you want an inventory to be broken out in a bit more detail. Well, I can go to the trial balance, and the first thing I want to do is select the Add button and add a few financial subgroups. These will all be part of inventory, so I'll have to give them an index and give them a name. So we'll start there. We'll go ahead and do uh, work in progress. We'll put that right below raw materials, and then we'll do one more. This will be finished goods, and I will stick that right below work in process. So now that I have my three new subgroups, I can go ahead out to my inventory and assign the appropriate subgroups. Once I do that and I go back to the financial statements, now you'll see the subgroups are listed out on your financial statement. If I need to later go back and edit or delete one of those subgroups, I simply select the edit option, financial subgroup, and in this case, let's say I'm going to go ahead and delete finished goods. Once I do that and I go back to the financial statements, Again, you'll notice that that is no longer showing on my financial statements. So this feature will give you the flexibility to add, edit, and delete subgroups to get more detail on your financial statements.